Are you looking for action figures? Then head over to The Chosen Prime. The link is in the description. Just follow that. And man, they got everything your heart desires. Transformers, 5-2 toys, Power Rangers, Turtles, Marvel, DC, statues, whatever you want. Just go over and follow that link, man. You can order everything you want. Just order. Just go over there and order. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Thank you for coming back as always. I appreciate it. I really hope you're having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another 5-2 toy reveal review. Yeah. <laughs> All right, today I'll be taking a look at 5-2 toys BB-37 Vaporwave. This is a recolor and a kind of a, heavy, a little retool on the head uh, for a Reaper. It's a praying mantis. And she's a beauty. She's pink. So there you go. Nicely done. Like the artwork. Same over here. Beast mode to uh, box mode. And there's the back right there. Looks pretty good. Five year anniversary. Looks pretty good. So yeah, very excited to get this one. Kind of limited. I uh, had to get this one off eBay. Pretty kind of a little hard to find, but not too hard. Uh, but there you go. Let's just get right to the review. That's what you came for. Yeah. All right. There's Vaporwave in her box charger. Looks really good. I uh, just want to show real quick the uh, card it comes with. Looks very nice. The BB37 Vaporwave. She's got those big, beautiful bug eyes. Then on the back, if you want to read that, you can pause for the calls. You got some stats. So pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. All right. Let's get her out of her little box charger. We'll take a look at the box charger as well. There you go. Very nice. I love the pink. You got the vapor wave and nice little pink, and then you got little blue outlines. So that is very nice. It says box charger, caution. Get the hair off of there. And then there you go. Very nice. Put that over to the side, and she, here she is in her cube mode. Beautifully done. Got the nice pink, nice kind of a dry brush or whatever silver paint to it. It's not all the way silver, but you can you see some you know pink details in there. So very nice pink paint right here. White paint, white paint, some translucent pink as well throughout. Dark pink and light pink. Got some gold, some nice uh, accent points right there with the white and the pink. Looks. I like how it's like brushed, like um, you know, uh, blended in right there. That's kind of what that is too, as well. It's kind of blended in a little bit. But you can tell there's a little darker pink right here. It kind of blends into the. Kind of looks like lemonade, <laughs> pink lemonade. And you got a little green right here, a little right there, and you got a white, nicely painted. Love the translucent pink. Once again, the faded in looks good. Then the top, once again, you got the pink with a kind of a silver coat on it. Looks good. And then underneath, you got some gold paint right here, some gold paint throughout right there. So very beautifully done, nicely painted. So there you go. That is Vaporwave in her cube mode. And real quick, there she is next to Reaper and Pulse. And then you got Vaporwave. This was the first one that came out. And you got a recolor of that one. And then pink. Looks really cool. And real quick, there they are in their box chargers. Looks like you got Reaper, Pulse, and Vapor Wave. And they all stick together. Looks pretty cool. So there you go. And Crappy Garnets, Crappy Toll Paper, some Pepper Spray, and Care Bears for scale. All right, let's see if I can transform her. All right, so what you want to do is you just want to come on and tab this right here. Like from there. You want to come over here and lift this up out of the way. Then you want to untab the arms right there. And right there, to have them, untab them from the legs. And you want to open this up right here. You want to lift the head up, slide it up like that, and then move it up like that. Close the chest in like that. Move the arms out like that. And move these out again like that. You can situate it any way you want to. All right, come back here. You want to open up the untab from right here and untab right there so you can release her legs. You want to untab this as well too. These are tabbed in, so tabbed in a lot of areas. <laughs> All right, lift this up like that. Move that down. Untab the wings like that. Then you can spread open the wings. Hopefully, yeah, move that out 
and then move that out. Okay, close in. Okay, then you want to kind of move that up like that. Pull out the legs so you can get them situated. Move these down. I'm going to move this down. And you can move these up. You can have it any way you want to. You can situate it any way you want. But I'm just going to do it like that. And then move out our legs again. Move those up. And move those up. And there you go. That is how you transform Vaporwave. Let's see if I can get her stand up a little bit. I'll have to clean her up a little bit. But there you go. Wow, she's beautiful. All right, there is Vaporwave, and man, she looks awesome. The paint on this is spectacular. But here she is real quick. She does have a new head sculpt, kind of a, you know, she doesn't have the uh, antennas or anything like that. And she got the new eyes. But love, I love, it's got that honeycomb look to it. But I love how the red, kind of the pink goes into the pink, a little lighter inside. It kind of just blends in. And you got translucent pink for the head sculpt. Right through here and all throughout. And you got this nice gold paint. Once again, you can see that. And I love how the darker pink brings out the little tubes. And you got some kind of a red, reddish pink right there. White paint right there. Gold, translucent pink. And you got some gold right there too. White right there. That's uh, That might not be paint. I think that's just plastic. But once again, the uh, very nicely done pink white translucent pink dark pink up here and then you got some gold and some green light green or kind of a turquoise green i guess what you would call it i don't know what color green that is but really nice and once again the wings got that nice like silver layer of paint over it but you can see the pink too so that is freaking awesome i might say they had she had white paint on her there's a little white paint but all this most of it up here is just plastic once again, beautifully done on the wings. Translucent pink right here. You got gold pink right, or gold paint right here on the tail, or not tail, but top of the tail. Nice translucent pink. Once again, the silver just like that covers it a little bit. Nice little coat. So, well, beautifully done. I like it. All right, so we're gonna look at articulation. Okay, so this is kind of loosey goosey. I mean, yeah, I think you can. If you want to push it up and you can get it more of an up and down, but if you want to push it in, it's a little more, not as loose. But you can go out to there, do a little thing like that. You do have a swivel and you got to, you can look up and down too. So nicely done on the head movement for there. Beautifully done. I love that pink. Kind of got like, it looks like it's got a little silver paint to it as well. All right. So these arms go all the way around. You do got a little wiggle waggle right there, so you can get some movement out there. You do have a bend for her arm, go down to there just about, and up to there, right there. And then you do got a bend right here too, and you got a bend right here. So, nice articulation for the hands. All right, you do got an up and down for the abdomen, and you got a swivel right here. So that's good. You can move these up. They're on a little hinge and they're on little ball joints. So you can go up and down, swivel around right there. This goes up and down too as well. A nice little swivel. The wings can go flop back there and then this can move down, up and down. So very nice. And this can move up as well. So lots of movement there. All right, for the legs, uh, they're all the same uh, right there. Got a swivel right here. You got a bend right here and a bend right here and that is it and same thing for the rest of them the tail can go up and down and that's about it and these can go flop a little bit right there no swivel on the tail or anything like that so very nice really nicely articulated one of my favorite molds from 52 toys that's why i bought three of them so there you go that is vaporwave in her articulation and sculpt work. And the paint job is just freaking beautiful. I love it. Oh, I forgot to show her chest too. Nice, once again, that green paint right there. And you got a nice little white symbol for a uh, insect. 
So very nice. I forgot to show you that. Once again, more paint. And just show her real quick next to Reaper. This is the original one. Like I said, it is a different head sculpt. Totally different. So you can tell he doesn't have that, all that stuff. But everything else is uh, the same, just a recolor. That's all it is, but just a different head sculpt. So there she is next to Reaper. And there is Pulse also with them. So like I said, you got Reaper, Pulse, and Vaporwave. Now these are just straight recolors. This is a recolor with a do head sculpt. You got the beautiful blue back there. Looks really good too. Man, I love this mode. It's awesome. So there you go. There are some comparisons. And Crappie Garnets, Crappie Toilet Paper, some Care Bears, some uh, Pepper Spray, and Squeaks for Scale. Folks, let's talk about some 52 Toys Vaporwave. You already know what I'm gonna say. I love her. It's awesome. It's probably one of my favorites out of the three, but I love this mode. I don't know what the pretty management. It just I don't know. I like it. Uh the Q mode, you know, it's kind of boring, but it is what it is. Uh, I like how the engineering, you know, they can turn your cube into you know a bunch of animals. It's awesome. 52 Toys, man. Oh, once again, you always you got me. You got me hooked. I'm down that rabbit hole. I love getting in some 52 toys. Uh, transformation is real easy. Shouldn't take it that long to figure this one out. Uh, the, uh, you know, the uh, insect mode, spectacular. Articulation is out of this world. Tons of articulation. The paint, once again, spectacular. I love how the pink, and they got like a little silver sheen to them on the wings. You got gold, you got pink, you got green. I mean, golly, this thing is just painted so freaking awesome. I love it. Yeah, one of my favorites if they make another, if they do a recolor of this one, another one, I'm definitely going to get it. I really like it. It's very good. Well, I hope you like my review over uh, over this Fi2 Toys of uh, Vaporwave. Looks pretty good. Uh, hit me up some like, share, prayers. Oh, it's got glitter. I mean, it kind of got like, you know, like a glitter effect in some of the areas. I don't know. It's like, it's got pink right there. Wow. Just beautiful, man. The paint job on this is just spectacular. I don't, oh, man. Wow. Hit me up some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Go down and hit that su uh, sub button for me if you don't mind. It really helps out the channel. Hit me up some comments. Tell me uh, what you thought of the review and what you think of her. And I guess I'll see you in the next uh, 52 Toys review. And as always, be good to yourself. Help 52 Toys. And good night, folks. Oh, let's claw the baby's eyes out. Oh, man, I hate it when you do 52 Toys. Oh, yeah. She's got bug eyes. I love it, man. She's awesome. Praying Manus. Yeah, cool stuff. Great job, Fatu Toys. Great job.